Um, but yeah, I didn't even look like me. I was like, okay, I'm all for having my makeup look amazing. I, I lo I'm all for having somebody beat my face. But can I still look like myself when you're done? I don't want to look like, I don't know, whomever else. I mean, I, can, I think I look okay. I mean, I'm cute. Just so we're clear, I am, I am aware of that. Hello, Incredible One. I am Darnell A. Jervy, and I'm so excited to welcome you to Incredible Factor TV. Now, if you ask me, this is the place you must be to learn optimization strategies to make your life and business an incredible one. Every week, we take a question from someone in our community, and this week, we're talking to Sherry. And she asks, Hi, Darnell. I've been booking a lot of speaking engagements, but the majority of them are free. They are, after all, the easiest to get. I've heard you say before that there's no such thing as a free speaking engagement. So can you share a few tips to help me to maximize these speaking gigs? First and foremost, Sherry, thank you so much for asking your question. And yes, I do believe that every single speaking engagement is a paid speaking engagement. I personally believe that who is paying you is what fluctuates. Sometimes it's gonna be the meeting host or the meeting planner, right? That's when they give you an honorarium or they can meet your speaker fee or they buy copies of your books or whatever the case might be. Maybe they even pay your travel. The other opportunities, which are the easiest to get, are the ones where your audience pays you. Now, depending upon the stipulations that are in place with the organization, you may or may not be able to actively make a resource available to your audience, i.e. make a sales offer from the front of the stage. But even if you can't make an offer from the front of the stage, it does not mean you have to walk away unpaid from that engagement. Here's a personal example. Um, recently, I went and I spoke at a women's conference, 200 women, um, approximately 200 women in my breakout session. I love breakout sessions, by the way, because the people who come to your session are the people who want to hear from you. So that's a great way to make sure you are segmenting the overall audience at a conference so that you can talk specifically to the people who consider hiring you if you shared information that would make a difference for them, right? So approximately 200 women in my room did my thing for 45 amazing minutes, rocked the house. They were so super excited. At the end, I'm looking at a line. I happen to call this my groupie line. I'm looking at a line of approximately 75, 80 people in this, in this line waiting to have a conversation with me. This is where they pass me their business cards. They tell me how I changed their life. They're excited about me. They want to take a picture, whatever is happening in that line. Out of that line, I collected everyone's contact information. Now, I was not allowed to sell or position any type of resource for this audience, just to give you a frame of reference. But I was able to collect business cards as people came up to me. So I walked away from there with you know, 75, 80 business cards and went home and did some follow-up. Within two weeks of that event, I had eight clients who paid me on average $10,000. I had three paid speaking engagements that were on average $3,500. You do the math because at this point we're closing in on $100,000 from one 45 minute free speaking engagement. And you can do the same thing. And when you join me for the after party that goes down on my blog at IncredibleOneEnterprises.com, I'm gonna share some more insight on how you can do exactly the same thing in your business. But now I wanna hear from you. How are you able to leverage free or what I call business development speaking engagements to build your business and to get in front of your ideal clients? What can you share with Sherry that will help her to be able to do the same in her business? I love hearing your two cents and I'm always so excited when you join me for the after party that goes down on our blog. And if you enjoyed this episode, do me a favor and subscribe you can do it right here on this page by hitting the subscribe key. Then please use social media to share it with your friends, fans, and followers. And if you are ready to make sure that you are positioned to profit in your business, then you'll wanna make sure that you're receiving our weekly easing the incredible factor. It does come out every single Walk It Out Wednesday and it would be my pleasure to make sure that it is delivered to your inbox. This has been Danielle A. Jervy from Incredible Factor TV saying be better, be stronger, and more than anything, be incredible. The world's waiting on you. I'll see you guys next time. Take care.